In this video, the principles of laparoscopic cholestectomy, that is the removal of the gallbladder, with the use of keyhole surgery, will be explained. So, first things first, the operation is performed under a general anesthetic, often called a GA. Um, and once the patient is anesthetized and placed appropriately uh, in the operating room or operating theater, the surgeon then, uh, in the first step, inserts a instrument into the abdomen to create what's called pneumoperitoneum, i.e. gas inside the abdomen, which is carbon dioxide. So typically there will be a small slit just below the belly button that will allow him to insert the camera inside the belly uh, to be able to see inside and that there is light attached to it that will allow him to place further ports, ports and there are usually three, uh, just below the breastbone, just below um, the rib cage on the right, and, and the third one uh, more to the side. Instruments are then inserted, and the picture that the surgeon wants to see is depicted over here. So the liver is at the, at the top, the gallbladder is displayed over here, and the gallbladder is attached to the bile tube. This is the main artery that supplies the liver and then it splits into two and on the right side it gives off a small artery to the gallbladder. So the principle involves um, that the surgeon isolate this part of the gallbladder called the cystic duct, the tube that connects it to the bile duct, and isolate this artery uh, to be able to safely clip these and divide these. So typically the surgeon would then insert instruments that would pull the gallbladder in these two directions so as to stretch this area and then begin his dissection in this plane to isolate these structures. So once he's isolated these structures, he would then place clips on these like that and another one further up and put a clip on the artery two clips and then one a bit further away and then he would use scissors to cut these structures. And once he's achieved that, he would then start the mobilization of the gallbladder, trying to retain the gallbladder stones inside in an upward fashion using diathermy or heat energy and hence start the dissection to release the gallbladder from the side as well as underneath the gallbladder and try and move it upwards and outwards. So once the gallbladder has, this section has been completely released, he then inserts a bag uh, with an instrument and the gallbladder is inserted inside the, the bag and the bag is then withdrawn through the belly button. The surgeon would then inspect this area and make sure that there is no bleeding point or leakage of bile or any other issue. We will also now just quickly see how the cut ends of the bile tubes uh, look like. So let's just have another look at that. In this picture, you can see the surgical clips applied over here uh, and on the artery uh, over here. And the, the gallbladder, the cystic duct, the tube that connected to the bile duct has been, has been divided and the artery uh, has been divided and this is just to provide a little bit more clarity to what I was talking about before. A further variation on the operation is what's called a subtotal cholecystectomy, i.e. not the whole of the gallbladder is removed. And that is necessary when there is a lot of inflammation in this part and the surgeon is worried that by trying to isolate this tube, the cystic tube and the artery he may endanger the main bile tube, and that is a significant complication. So in trying to prevent that, and because of the inflammation, and he's unsure about the anatomy in this area, he may sometimes elect to remove the gallbladder starting from the top and, and bringing it downwards and stopping short of this cystic duct, but controlling this part of the gallbladder called the Hartman's pouch and then removing it and using using the same process as I explained before in introducing a bag and once he's removed that he then puts it inside the bag. Now this is slightly different from the one I explained before and this is called a subtotal 
uh, quality is stacked to me. Subtotal. Okay, so that culminates a brief and simple explanation of gallbladder removal with keyhole surgery.